So, any questions you have right now, if not, I'm gonna go to the board and I'm gonna go through some percentages of sequence of events you've got to do to get a move in. The ones we go is get leads, right? Yep. All right, so you got a lead. Leads turn into phone calls. All right. Phone calls then turn into Zoom meetings. Am I writing this big enough for you? Yep, you're good. Okay, let's make sure. All right, Zoom meetings. Then the Zoom meetings turn into tours. Tours then turn into move-ins. All right? So now, the math is the path, right? So if the math is the path, you have got to get X number of leads to get X number of move-ins. Right. But now, if you just do the math backwards, and we'll go through the percentages, but ultimately right now, we're in September, all right? So you need to write down I'm in September, and I want X number of move-ins for September. October, November, and December. I would do these four months. Now, we're already like 10 days, 11 days, 12, whatever. I, only what day we're on, 13th. Where we're like 12, we're already like a week and a half into September. So this, this might not be a, you know, that great of a number, whatever that number is. Right. But I still would put a number. But here, I would start to have my monthly goal of I want X number of move-ins. And then all you do is take that number, okay? Let's say, for instance, in October, Willie wants three move-ins. Okay. All right? And September, we're going to change that little number sign there, and we're going to say you're going to get a good start at one this month. Okay. Fair, right? It gives yep. you... Two and a half weeks, whatever, almost three weeks to get one, gives you a head start, and October gives you three. That's what I would do. Okay. Now, in order to do that, how many leads is going to take you to get phone calls? All the way down here. Now, I can give you the numbers pretty much. This is what happens, especially now. They The numbers increase as you get better at your craft. As you get better at anything, things get easier, they get more efficient, anything in life, right? Same with this business here. Now, if you want a move-in, let's say you want the ultimate goal is to get one here, right? It's typically yep. going to take two tours. Okay. Typically. Now, could you score both tours into both moves? Absolutely. But typically, especially early on, to get two tours, you're going to need four move-ins, I mean, I'm sorry, four Zoom meetings to get two tours to one move-in. To get four Zoom meetings, typically is six phone calls. Okay. Now, these six phone calls could be the same number of leads that you have. Okay. Or it may not be. Because in the, and depending on how you want to direct traffic, I'm directing traffic like I showed you on my business card, website, or a billboard starting October, I thought it was 20, I think it's October 25th. I talked to them a day about design. Anyway, long story short. So I can have a number of leads up here, <coughs> but my ultimate goal is to get them on the phone. I'm a firm believer in this business. You've got to get them on the phone in order to sell them. For instance, a place for mom does it this way. Somebody goes online to get all the information. Somebody, right? If you ever, you ever been through that process with a place for mom? No. Okay. What you want to do is you want to do that. Now give them fake information. Don't, don't. Right, right, don't, right. Yeah. Just get on there and go assisted living. You find a place for mom. Do some, some search. Just put some bull crap in there where you go, right. uh, what city. And, and they're going to lead you through a process, put name and phone number, right. blah, 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 blah. And then once you now put fake number and all that stuff, once you do all that, at the very end of that little thing, it says a, a representative will call you. Okay. Now, why do they do that? Because they understand. They've been doing this a long time. They do it in every state. They understand the key to this game is the phone call. You've got to get them on the phone. So if somebody texts you, 
about placement is okay, but not optimal. That's really more of a lead. Someone emails you, someone tells you that a friend, like for instance, you told me, um, let's say the, the couple wants to move here, right? And they'll reach out to me. Right. That, that's a potential prospect slash lead, really a prospect at this point, because I haven't talked to them. Right. Then, let's say, let's say you gave me the information. I don't do it, but let's say you gave me the information. <laughs> if you gave me the information, that would be a lead. But it's not really until I get them on the phone. Right. Right. When I get that's the objective. I could have a binder full of 25 names. We did this all the time in a large community where a place for mom, caring.com, others, we'd have a database and, and all that stuff. And we'd have a bunch of people up here that are either prospects we've never talked to before uh, or leads express interest, but we never got them on the phone. So you need to get a, a phone call going. That is where the action starts. So if this is the ultimate goal to move in, this is where it starts. This is where the math begins. Now, how do you get the leads? Billboard, social media, which I wouldn't start with a billboard. I start with social media. I start with your network, developing, expanding that network, doing that. But get them to a phone call. So we can look at the math here. If you are looking to get a move in and you know you can get two tours you've got a 50% chance to go from a tour to a move in. All you need to do is get two tours. Mm. If you want a move in, all you need to do from a zoom meeting to a move in is 25%. You need four zoom meetings. Now, to clarify about the Zoom meeting, if you haven't seen it yet, go in the Academy. I've got a, um, I don't know how long the video is, it's as long as I had, I, I got an actual interview, a Zoom meeting with one of my clients in the Academy. Mm -hmm. I go through a five uh, PowerPoint slide and you can and really take all that information, okay? Just just put your own name and that stuff, but you use if you want to use the same information, I mean, I don't really care, it's not, I mean, Stuff I created, it works. I use it all the time. But, and you'll get to a place where four Zoom meetings will probably turn into two move ins. Okay.